Now, when talking about rectilinear motion, we can we sometimes encounter problems of um, dealing with the motion of multiple particles. One way to simplify the analysis of these problems is to discuss the relative position of one particle with respect to another. In order to do that, we need to use the same origin, that's the same uh, zero point of the coordinate system, along with the same time system, so the same zero point of time. And if we do so, then we can talk about the relative position of B of one point with respect to A, another point. And this is how we would write that. Um, the coordinate position of B with respect to A is equal to the coordinate of B, the x sub B, minus the coordinate of A, x sub A. Or equivalently, that could be written as x sub B is equal to x sub A plus x of B relative to A. Similarly, for the velocity, we could write that the velocity of B is equal to the velocity of A plus the velocity of B relative to A. And we can write the acceleration of B is equal to the acceleration of A plus the relative acceleration of B with respect to A. Why would we do this? Well, using these new coordinates, uh, um, the relative position of B with respect to A, we can often simplify the analysis of the motion of several particles. 